Hey everyone, I just want to make a quick video about something that happened and well you see the other day the rugby was on so I had the TV on as you do and just your standard South Australian ads were playing and, and there was one about saving on the price of water and it got me thinking about something and I wanted to go tweet at Steve. Stephen Marshall, the Premier of South Australia, and that is how I came to learn that I am now blocked by him. I have a theory. I think I know why I'm blocked by him, probably because of one of the more recent tweet threads I tweeted at him, and let's have a quick look at that. Two quick side notes. Vicky didn't block me, and I reckon there's a what do you mean video that corresponds with pretty much every point I make here, with a few exceptions like this first one. How will privatising our trains benefit South Australians? Which buildings in Adelaide have the flammable cladding? Have we abolished that gay panic defence yet? Port Piri, lead, isn't good for children or anyone. The next tweet, Justice Richard White ruled that not allowing the Bugnara and the Anumatna people to participate in a vote on the construction of a nuclear waste dump doesn't go against the Racial Discrimination Act of 1975. How? Charging hospital staff parking fees equals staff leaving patients. The next tweet, is there anyone else in SA suffering the same way Anne-Marie Smith did? Those pipelines at the beach for pumping sand from beach to beach. $50 million. You believe that's a good investment? Do you really believe if pokies take notes, people will gamble less? And open borders. Why New South Wales? And we worked out that one pretty much because the footy. And last tweet. What happened to the three minutes of missing footage from the day Wayne Feller Morrison was taken from Yatla to the hospital before he died? Vicky Sports Club did well in the sports rort. Intentionally slash recklessly causing bushfire equals 20 years, but property damage via arson equals life. Now, I gathered some responses from people on Twitter that I think sum up why Steve has shot himself in his foot in multiple ways here. First one being, I'm pretty reasonable and I'm kind of getting known on Twitter as that person that really, really gives a shit. The political platypus that actually cares about South Australia and all these important issues. Probably not a good move to go blocking me if you're the Premier. And then the whole Twitter badge of honour thing is like, in a way, you did me a favour, dude. People are a bit proud of me for that one. And finally, as hardcore lion put, go subscribe to him. The whole world knows you're a coward now, dude. That's, that is unfortunate. And the final point is, if you didn't block me, Steve, I wouldn't have put such a focus on you. You can't do this to yourself. And by the time I finish making this video and uploading everything, I'll put the results of this poll as the thumbnail. Thanks for watching, like, subscribe, have a good one, and if you got Twitter, go tweet at Steve.